Good morning, families. Buenos días, familias. Today we are going to talk about rhyming words. Palabras que riman. Now, rhyming words, I like to... I, I, I like to say that they all belong in the same house. Me gusta decir que todas las palabras que riman pertenecen en la misma casa, como ustedes pertenecen en la misma casa con sus hermanos y sus familias. Es lo mismo con las pala algunas palabras. Why are they rhyming words? These rhyming words sound have the same ending sound. So, words that sound the same and end the same. Son palabras que suenan iguales y terminan con el mismo sonido con las mismas palabras. Let's look at some examples. Pen. Pen is un lapicero. Pen, como ven aquí, it ends with the E-N. Pen, men, and ten. They all have the same ending sound, which is E-N. Todas estas, estas tres palabras tienen el mismo sonido al final. Por eso, por eso le decimos que son palabras que riman. The E-N, if you take the beginning sound away, si que te quitamos la primera palabra, mi primer sonido, N, N, N. Todos terminan con la E y la N. They all end with the E and the N. So we have P, N, M, N, T, N. Pen, men, ten. To, escuchamos el N at the end of the word. These are rhyming words. They all belong there. I wouldn't be able to put an ig in there like pig porque no tiene el mismo sonido al final. So they belong in the same house. Todos pertenecen a la misma familia porque son palabras que riman. They have the same ending sound. Let's look at another example, another house. Vamos a ver otra casa with rhyming words. We have a p in in, w, in, win, and we have b, in, bin. So we have pin, win, bin, in, in al final, como su side word, in. They all have the same ending sound, which is in, in, in. The only difference is, la única diferencia is the beginning letter, the beginning sound. La primera letra es la única diferencia. Now, let's try to read these words together. Remember that as good readers, we want to make sure that we sound out the sounds of the word. Como buenos lectores, queremos asegurarnos que tenemos que, le que de leer todos los sonidos en cada palabra. This is a can. This is a can. This is a mm, mm, an, man. This is a man. So we have can, can, and man have the same ending sound. If I take the beginning sound away, what two letters? Does it end with? ¿Cuáles son las dos letras que terminas? A, N, A, N. La A y la N, la A y la N. Therefore, they belong in the same house. Están en la misma familia. Can, man. It has the same ending sound. Let's try to figure this one out. You ready? Van. 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 We have a P, N. Pan. So we have van, van, and pan. So pan, pan, and van. We take away the beginning sound and we end with the same, we have the same ending sound. Tenemos el mismo final. A, N, and, and, pan, van. How about this one? Let's see if you can figure this one out. Beginning sound is f and fan, fan. And we have m man, man, 
and fan also have the same ending sound. Therefore, they are rhyming words. They belong in the same house. Pertenecen en la misma casa porque tienen el mismo final. Today, you are going to do a couple of things. Van a hacer algunas cosas. We are going to complete. <clears throat> we already have our ending sound here, our rhyming words. You are going to try to figure out the beginning here. So we have ran, como el ratón, ran, corrió. This is a pan, a fan, and a can. All rhyming words. They all belong in the same house. Todos son palabras, todas son palabras que riman, pertenecen en la misma casa. I would also like you to create some words. You have this one for and I want you to try to create, just like I did here, uh, your own little house with the E-N. So this is how it should look, the N. For pen, men, ten. Create your own little house, your own little house with rhyming words, su propia casita con sus palabras que rima. Me gustaría también que le pusieran la ilustración al lado. I would like you to also illustrate what it is next to it, just like I did here with our and sound, fan, man. Me gustaría que me dibujaran también el dibujito al lado, okay? So we're going to do this one, this activity, and then after that, I want you to try to create your own little house with your rhyming words. Bye. Have fun.